Nancy Hyde. So today I decided that I'm going to start content because, quite frankly, I got nothing else to do. So yesterday I did my uh, hair with a clear coat, and it's it's a lot better, but it's no Henry job. Anyway, just clear coat, just clear coat. So I decided <laughs> that I'm going to make content because, quite frankly, I got nothing else to do, really and truly. So. You know how I have this weird habit of collecting ephemera? I know, that's my favorite hobby. Anyway, so I'm, uh, I <clears throat> have decided to show you weird crap that I'm doing uh, during the quarantine and see if it lasts past that. So today I went to, uh, in my, in my get out of the casita uh, ventures, I went to Dunkin' Donuts to get a, to get a bagel. I know it's odd, but I like it. Anyway, so I I uh, didn't get a bagel because they sold out of bagels. And then I said, okay, give me those hash browns because they have that sour creamy chive sort of thing. And she said, no, we ran out of uh, hash browns too. I'm like, it's three o'clock on a Sunday. Why are you going to run out of all that shit? At a Dunkin' Donuts. I thought Dunkin' Donuts for sure. Anyway, so okay. I got a, I got a kolache. Mm, don't recommend the kolaches at, uh, Baskin Robbins. I thought, kolache, maybe I'll go to, uh, maybe I'll drive all the way out to Bucky's. Right? Bucky's kolaches. Mmm. Good stuff. But then I, I started up 410. I was way over on, on, uh, San Pedro and 35. I don't know why I didn't go up 35. But then I, uh, went down San Pedro because I thought maybe I'd figure out something to do in the meantime that didn't involve driving all the way up to Bucky's. But, um, and I did. I'll get there when I get there. So I got to 410. And I was thinking, oh, maybe I'll go to Ikea instead because Ikea's on the way. And so, uh, but then I, I said, oh, I need rice bowls because, you know, me and my new Korean obsession. And uh, I said, oh, okay, I'm on 410. I'll take 410 down to the Korean uh, area of San Antonio. And let me tell you. When you don't go up, up there very often, that 35 corridor is weird. 35 and 410, you don't know which of those things comes first. Like, does, does Ritterman come after Judson or Judson after Ritterman? Or where's Eisenhower? And is it Walsam that I want? And no, it wasn't Walsam that I wanted. It was Rittenhouse. Anyway, so I went to the Korean market over there. And so here is the stuff that I got. So I'm going to show you my haul. Uh, I know, I know. It's not great content. I'm just saying. I'm putting content there. You can judge it for all you care. I don't care. Um, so I'm going to show you what I got. First, I got, well, I got this and I already ate it. <laughs> so uh, the theme of my Korean adventure today was uh, oddities that Emily has seen in, uh, in Korean dramas or in uh, BTS uh fodder across the <laughs> across the internet so so first i got this and you can't i'll maybe post a a, a picture of it uh, in its in its prime but it's a it's an ice cream cone a soft served ice cream cone in in a little cup anyway and it comes all the way from korea it's made in korea as a matter of fact it's imported into hanover maryland but Anyway, I don't know how many calories it was. So, anyway. Okay, so there was that. Next. Oh, so I was watching this drama, right? And it's about uh, it's about uh, this dude, of course. He was a prisoner. And uh, sorry for shaky camera work. But uh, <clears throat> anyway, he was a prisoner. He was an orphan. That seems to be a, a good theme of, of dramas. And, um, and so uh, his... Uh, this lady who took him under her, her wing uh, had a dumpling shop, and it was a horrible dumpling shop. Anyway, after he gets out of prison from being a gangster, he goes and he takes care of her uh, dumpling shop, and it's called uh, Sweet Stranger and Me. It's this really odd-looking, really hot, odd-looking guy with broad shoulders and this 
this big nose. Oh, and then and then also a really good looking uh, Korean standard sort of guy. And uh, anyway, so I've been wanting gyoza, and so these are the gyoza that I got. Hang on. Ah, no. Why don't you turn around? <laughs> How can I turn this around? Uh, so hard. Okay. So these are the gyoza I got. Can you see them? Ah, 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 ah. Anyway, <laughs> I have to work on camera work. So, yeah. So those were those were a dollar ninety nine, um, and uh, so they were on sale. So kimchi gyoza go in the go in the um, freezer. Ah. Oh! And then, and then, check this shit out because they're they're kind of old content, but I don't care, and because it's BTS. And so, you ready for it? What is that? Anyway, are you ready for it? Because here it is. Uh, it's Jin. It's Jin. It's Jin. 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 It's Jin on a cold brew. Jin, my favorite, my BTS bias. Can you tell? Because it's got it's got a uh, condensation on it. Uh, it's Jin on a cold brew. Jin, Jin, and then of course I couldn't just get Jin because then the other guys would be sad because I'm OT seven really, but there was no <laughs> there was no J Hope and so there's there's Jimin. Hi, Jimin. And then, and then also, here's, here's Cookie. Hi, Cookie. Don't look, don't look, look at the camera, Cookie. Anyway, Cookie doesn't want to look at the camera. There's Jungkook. I don't know what this coffee is, but it's an Americano. That's the favorite thing for, uh, for Koreans to order on, um, <laughs> on soap operas. Ah, and so you see these things all the time because, uh, <clears throat> you know, um, um, placement marketing is like a big thing in Asian, uh, in Asian dramas. And so, uh, Maxim, Maxim and Maxim Gold, and, and they're not the kind of Maxim, you know, uh, these are, <laughs> it's a, it's a, <laughs> Emily, and, uh, they're, um, they're a coffee brand, you know, like freeze-dried coffee, like Taster's Choice. Anyway, but they're really, uh, they have really cool um, spokespersons. And so one of them is uh, Gong Yu. Ah, Goblin. Yes. Oh, Gong Yu Goblin. Anyway, so he 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 uh, sponsors uh, Maxim. And so you see a lot of these around uh, uh, Korean dramas, too. So I got that just to try it. It's clearly going to be bad, but what are you going to do? Ah, ah, ah. Oh, okay. And then, <laughs> sorry for looking at my nostrils. And, uh, so this next thing I just got because it looked cool. Uh, and it's the, still the summer in San Antonio, whether you like it or not, it's nearly September 1st and it's 100 degrees outside. Anyway, so this is the, the next thing that I got. It's watermelon soda. Hmm. Hmm. I say to you, huh. Um, Ishli said meow, but I say to you, huh. We'll see. We'll see. And then, dun, 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 because it's BTS and BTS also sponsors this you know when i was uh when i was in uh kazakhstan and um not uzbekistan but kazakhstan and on the way to kazakhstan i was in uh uh seoul for uh, 36 hours and um anyway lotte was like the big thing right because lotte owns everything and then in kazakhstan i stayed in a lotte uh hotel i recommend staying in lotte hotels they're really good anyway so but <laughs> Uh, uh, BTS has, has a marketing deal with, uh, Chilsung cider. So I don't know what it is, except it's lemon lime cider. Meh. We'll see. Mm -hmm. BTS.